welcome to my YouTube channel. Hey guys, how you guys doing? I hope everyone's well and keeping sane. Um, this is another hair care video and today <laughs> I'm not looking crusty like in my usual wash day videos. I'm so glad I had to shoot a video today. <laughs> So this video is all about gels. Are gels good for your hair? Should you use gels as a natural? Should you not? That's what we're gonna discuss. As you can see, I have laid down my hair and I have used gel. So I'm gonna tell you about my experience and whether you should try it out or not. So firstly, I want us to look at the pros and cons of using gels. Oh, but there's a lady in the background. Um, okay. Okay, so we're gonna start by looking at the pros of why we use gels, why gels are good, the good stuff. Firstly, they define your curls. So if you're looking for defined curls, you want to easy wash and go, you're gonna need a jelly or a gel to make those curls pop. That's what it's good for. Secondly, it provides longer lasting hairstyles. Like for example, if you're slicking down your hair, if you're using gel, it's gonna last longer. Um, thirdly, they are quite easy to refresh because you're just gonna spray water like with this. I'll just spray water and then the gel will, the hairstyle will be easily refreshed. I don't need to apply gel again. Um, and then fourthly, they're a great way for pulling back your hair. Exhibit A. <laughs> so if you want to do a sleek back, gel is is amazing in that because it pulls everything quite tightly and now let's look at the cons do the pros outweigh the cons let's see the first negative is that um, gels contain alcohol so let me first clarify not all alcohols are bad but some are very damaging for your hair so look out for al alcohols that have the word prop prop p-r-o-p in them so if there's isopropyl what, what's it called isopropyl isopropyl i'll write it down there for you guys but yes that alcohol is very very damaging so avoid products that have that alcohol if your gel has that product uh, if your gel has that ingredient in it then it is a very damaging product and should be avoided secondly they are very drying so they dry up your hair, taking out the moisture and you know, dry hair breaks, dry hair. Yeah, basically you don't want dry hair. Um, they also contain other damaging ingredients and these ingredients are hidden in, in the ingredient fragrances. You see why we don't like the ingredient fragrances on products is because it can mean anything. Like anything that they didn't want to write there could be included under fragrances. So that's why we shy away from fragrances or at least have a brand explain what is what is fragrances made up of, their ingredient. What? Because some brands, it is natural ingredients and they say fragrance because it's fragranced by an oil, but sometimes it is bad chemicals and they just put in fragrance and they're, done, they're covered. Um, the fourth thing you want to that's bad about gels is that they can cause buildup because gels are not getting absorbed into your hair, they're not doing anything good for your hair besides making it look good. They actually cause a lot of buildup because they're thick and they just sit on top of your hair, and some people reapply and reapply. And yeah, the fifth thing is that they don't provide moisture, so there's nothing good that comes from it besides making you look good. <laughs> so whether you use it or not is all about preference. But if you do decide to use a gel, my tip is that you don't keep it on, on your hair for longer than two days. If you do use a gel, use it closer to your wash day so that you know, okay, I have a day or two till my wash day, I can sleep down my hair, you know? But I would not recommend that you keep it longer than two days. I would not recommend that um, you do it yeah, for longer days. Do it if you if you want that sleek look, definitely go for it. It's, it's there for a reason, guys. It's one of those things that we can utilize as natural hair people, but we need to 
be careful about the product that we're choosing. So we want to choose a product that doesn't have harmful ingredients, but also we need to be careful with the way that we use the product. We don't want to keep it on for longer than two days. We want to, yeah, keep it, wash, put it in, wash it out, because it does no good for our hair. And I would not recommend that you do this every week. Give your hair a break, do it every now and again when you need to. Yeah, use it carefully, but it's definitely something you can use to enhance your looks. If you feel like you want to define your curls, definitely one of the things you can go for. But do not think gel is bad. I do think some ingredients in some gels are bad. I cannot tell you which gels to use because I have not used all of them. Um, I have used the Eco Styler. Let me just show you guys the gel I used. So I use this gel. I use this gel, um, it's alcohol free. Let's just see the ingredients. Where's the ingredients? Okay, there. Um, yeah, there's no alcohol in this one, as we said. And there's perfume which is fragrance, so we don't know what's in there. But yeah, the ones that they've listed are not bad. So this is the one I've used. It laid down my hair quite well. I tried, I tried the um, Afro Botanics Black Pearl Gel and it didn't, it didn't work well for me. Wait. Okay, that's my husband coming in. So I've tried the Afro Botanics black pearl is it black pearl black pearl hair jelly it's yellow in color that did not work for me because it had yellow residue on my head so see which ones you go for i'd recommend you try this one they also have it in black um heather used the one in black she's also a hair enthusiast on instagram she uses the black eco styler and it works amazingly for her too so either go for this clear one or the black one those are the only two that i can recommend at the moment but yeah that's it about gels let me know what your experience has been with gels do you like using gels have you used gels will you now start using gels <laughs> And yeah, if you don't know what to say, but you want to comment, just say healthy hair wins because it always does. And remember, if you want healthy hair, you need to put in the work consistently. Till the next video, ladies. Bye.